I'm Lisa Caddo reporting for the Archaeology Podcast Network at EAA in Glasgow. So today I am talking with, introduce yourself. I'm Kieran Baxter from the University of Dundee. Wonderful. Thanks for talking with us today. So is this your first time at EAA? Yes, it is. Ooh, what do you think so far? Yeah, no, it's good. I've uh, been here very briefly, but it's a really good buzz to it. So yeah, I'm excited. That's great. What What do you find? You, know, you said that you've been here a short time, but what do you find most exciting so far? Um, I think it's just a really, it's a kind of um, a sort of multidisciplinary environment. I think it's really nice to see the kind of the range of the stuff that, that from what I've seen. Um, so that's what I'm looking forward to in the um, in the papers and the sessions is to see that kind of uh, people coming from different angles and different methods and sort of exciting time to be um, sort of seeing that, that kind of collaboration going on. So, yeah. That's great. And are you presenting this week? Uh, yes. Well, I'm, I'm co-presenting with uh, my colleagues Alice Watson and Tessa Poller. We're presenting on a, a, a visualization project for the Surf Hillforts uh, project. So that's, um, that's this afternoon. Nice. Can you tell me a little more about it? Give us a little preview. Yeah, so it's um, we're uh, sort of working alongside the surf excavations, which is a, so it's a field school excavation, and we're um, trying to introduce some visualization um, from uh, sort of bringing together diff- different mm-hmm. creative practitioners to look at sort of new and creative ways of uh, taking all of this data that's being generated during the process of excavation and putting it together into uh, some some kind of kind of online resource which is a bit more uh, sort of interactive and uh, use a bit more sort of creative in the way that that, that data is represented. That's great. And a little birdie told me something about aerial archaeology and photography. Can you tell me about that? Yeah, so um, my in my own work, I use aerial photography combined with computer-generated imagery to make animated uh, sort of visualizations or interpretive visualizations of, of sites. Um, so that's my own background. I come from a background in creative practice rather than archaeology. So I trained in, uh, in, in animation, in digital animation, and uh, the aerial photography is what I kind of bring to that to uh, get these kind of new angles and new ways of, of looking at um, or looking at the interpretations of these sites. Yeah. Oh, that's exciting. So are you on Twitter? Do you have a blog or anything that you'd like to plug? So um, I have a blog and it's all accessible through my website, which is at topofly.com. Um, so that's right, everything, everything goes into there. So my portfolio and blog and everything. Wonderful. Thank you so much for talking with us. Thank you.